this is the new Racer Pro, top of the range uh, helmet in this year's um, 2011 season. We're here at uh, Silverstone for the World Superbike Races. Um, you'll see on the website there's also some other videos of uh, some of our riders explaining some of the features of the, this new helmet. One of the main things that we get with this new helmet is uh, Class 1 optical clarity, which is uh, the best visibility across the full spectrum uh, of the aperture. The visor is 4.25 millimeters in the center, tapering down to 2.8 and then to 3 millimeters for the locking assembly. This gives Class 1 optical clarity, which is a, a big bonus for these guys who are concentrating so hard on the circuit. So whether it's for uh, short races, world superbike races, or endurance races, the focus and the concentration is something the guys get uh, 100%. Uh, on this model, we have a, a bigger aperture than previous. So again, visibility is a, a big bonus on this helmet. You can see downhill, uphill, coming out of turns. Uh, it's a real, real plus. The ventilation uh, is a big change on this helmet, uh, designed uh, on the computer as most things are these days. Uh, computational fluid dynamics gives us uh, a perfect laminar airflow through the helmet and over the helmet. With the double bladed spoiler giving stability at very high speeds, which these guys are going to do at the weekend. The inside is totally removable for uh, washing and cleaning, also for uh, size fitting. We can do small adjustments with different size cheek pads and there goes the phone. <laughs> Cut! Okay, also the interior uh, all comes out for washing and cleaning so you can keep the helmet in good condition so it's a, a pleasant helmet to, uh, to wear for, uh, for each journey. So for these guys also very important uh, because of the heat and the temperature when they're racing uh, they can change the, the liner if necessary. Uh, this helmet is also compatible with the, the new uh, Shark Bluetooth system, Shark Tooth, which has got a small compartment in the rear for the battery to sit. We fit a very slim, uh, lightweight control component on the outside of the shell, and everything else fits inside. So very neat, very tidy, uh, and a very top of the range specification uh, Bluetooth system. Okay, this is the uh, interior uh, of this helmet. So the EPS, the expanded polystyrene liner, which uh, gives control of the absorption in an accident. As you can see, all these separate sections are different densities. Uh, the main purpose is that we get good impact performance anywhere around the helmet, not just in certain spots. Uh, one of the most important aspects on a motorcycle helmet, whether it's on the circuit uh, or, or everyday use on the road, uh, is the possibility of an impact to the side of the helmet. We know generally helmets give quite good protection on the top, but the side of the helmet is a very vulnerable part. Uh, the side of the head is a, a thinner thickness in the skull, so we need to give good protection. As you can see the way that these components fit together, this gives us a good protection all around the helmet. And you can also see on the inside, Crumple Zone technology, which is utilised by Shark Helmets in uh, all of the range, is uh, really the latest specification, latest generation of uh, impact absorption. So not only looks good and performs good, but it also gives best protection.